Full schedule, full capacity, and full-on competition. It's all music to the ears of the seven Patriot League football teams set to compete in a 2021 fall season following a very non-traditional spring. Guys are fired up. It's been way too long since we've had a full schedule. Guys ready to compete. Um, we've been putting in a ton of work in this offseason since the spring, and everyone's ready to show what we can do. Um, you know, the, the biggest thing for, for us going forward is, you know, our culture's just been growing every day become more of a player-led team and you know I think that's ready to show out there on on Saturdays and everyone's just fired up for it. The Mountain Hawks will have a full complement of players heading into training camp a far cry from March and April when the team battled depth and COVID issues. Lehigh's 0-3 finish including just one offensive touchdown and two shutouts while the defense ranked among the best in the league. I think there's definitely some serious room for improvement. We've had a good good spring but I think a couple things we can get better at is uh, just being more physical. We can just physically uh, dominate um, the line of scrimmage and make people make people hurt whenever we, whenever they carry the ball and whenever they play us. And uh, just turnovers. I think if we create more turnovers, put our offense in a better position, really play team football, that can help the whole team be more successful. We were at the league minimum, um, you know, to play games at offensive line, and uh, and 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 a couple of those guys weren't completely healthy, so. <laughs> Um, I think it was difficult, um, you know, for our offense to operate uh, to the level that they normally would have been. Um, but I also know um, that we also made uh, some some progress over the course of the spring um, in, in, in every way. Lehigh will rely on its youth this season with 57 freshmen and sophomores on the roster compared to just 10 seniors and a pair of fifth years. Still, the experience, even from a small contingent, is already making all the difference. Those guys are not only great players, but they're great leaders, and they've been really, uh, you know, taking uh, taking charge uh, with, with, uh, with our team. Uh, that's been really great to see. Um, they've uh, set the standard and work ethic um, and, and the expectations um, that we have in the program. Part of that expectation, though, is winning, something the Mountain Hawks have struggled with over the last couple of seasons, dropping their last seven contests dating back to 2019. The, the final eight games were determined. They were one score games. I think five of them were determined on the very last play of the game. So our guys are going out there and competing all the way to the end. They're willing to work, they're, they're tough. They've shown, you know, the word I've used for our guys is grit. Um, they've been really gritty. I'm really proud of that part. But yes, we need to start putting it together and finishing games. I mean, we've been right there for in pretty much every contest we've had in the past seven games. And it's just a ball balance one way or the other. We just couldn't get the job done. But you can tell just by the way we work in the weight room on the field that we're hungry. And we're ready to go and we're ready to compete comes come this fall and we want to go out there and just show what we can do and it's going to translate to uh translate to wins just if we play how, how we want to play lehigh will open preseason camp next thursday and kick off its 11 game schedule on september 4th at goodman stadium on the scene i'm christy fulkerson for the service electric network